All right, ladies and gentlemen, and never I actually need to move my mic. Hold, I just realized it's kind of it's kind of in a weird spot. Hold up, let me move it right here. I think that's better. We're good now, okay? <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, and everything in between, we are back for some more Cowboy Bebop. Last time we watched episode eleven, and today we're well, it's not episodes, right? It's sessions. I'm sorry. We watched session eleven today. We'll be watching session twelve in the last session. <sighs> very dis disgusting disturbing nasty horrifying i don't know what words could really describe such a such a horrendous sight as the last episode but it was definitely something that i never want to see again it was very hard to edit that video i did not want to look inside that nasty fridge i don't think we need a recap um <laughs> all we need to know don't leave lobster in the fridge for a year ed is a demon and um i don't mess with rats don't hurt Ayn. That's it. That's all we got to say about that episode, right? Today we'll be watching episode 12. If you guys would like to watch full reaction, links are always in the description. Takes you over to Google Drive and BitChute. Use the site of your choice. Without further ado, let's get into episode 12 of our Space Cowboy Adventure. We're halfway through. After damn near you, right? Finally halfway through. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we'll get through it, bro. Just, just give me just, just a couple of weeks. Doing two episodes a week now. We'll be good. Don't worry. This is way too quiet. No, it's not. happen that was a shooting star you're supposed to make a wish it's not just not a tear of a warrior soul and that's what I was raised to believe at least you make the wish on the shooting star but he hitting them notes right now <laughs> he's hitting them notes is that Jupiter that big boy Jupiter over there all right, dragon ship. Wait, wait. What I just heard was the thing I've been waiting for. <laughs> oh my God. Vicious red eye, just what, already? That was clean. I like that they did that, bro. They brought back not only Vicious, but Red Eye. Probably the, the two craziest things we've seen so far. Okay, I'm here for it now. <laughs> I'm listening, bro. My ears are open. I am. Turn it up even more, dog. Come on now. Let's do this. Callisto. What is this? Are you sure about that? My skin might be pale, but I'm sure you get hypothermia. Now, who's the dragon? I think we know. <laughs> my boy Spike, that's definitely the dragon right there. That's my dude Spike. What is that crow? my crow right there
You know me, bro. When stuff starts to connect, I'm here for it. I love it. Session 12, Jupiter Jazz. That was Jupiter. I know my planets. I know my planets. <laughs> oh, man. What is Ed doing? That VR? <laughs> You're an original, aren't you? Cowboy. Who is that, Faye? Why'd she do that? Oh, now you gotta do it. Why she being? Why, why she choose now to do this bullshit, bro? Is on the screen. You're an original, aren't you? Cowboy. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, Ayn! <laughs> I just gave up. He was like, man, I can't deal with this kid. <laughs> Who? <laughs> Think I care about that wench? Man, we can make that back. Look, bro, she want to leave, she want to leave. Ooh. Ooh. That's a shirt. <laughs> That's Cap. You're capping. You're capping hard. I'm liking where this episode is going. So we've definitely seen that chick in the flashback. Clearly seemed vicious. Now we're heading over Callisto to scrap up. Crow, that's my house right there, dog. That's where I live. <laughs> that is my place of residence. That reminds me, this place looks depressing. I hope you're proud of yourself. Out here stealing money. That's all you about. You're an original, aren't you? Cowboy. Where are the tips at? <laughs> Where are my tip?
What are you breaking? <laughs> You're an original, aren't you? Cowboy. I don't like that name, Grin. <laughs> Can't you see <seem> straight? <laughs> Do okay. So what about just see Faye like that? Hey, yo, you spreading stuff? That Rona? What you doing? Where your mask at? <laughs> okay, you're a freak. You better back up. She's like, I would have stolen this anyway. <laughs> Man, you, got, you got a pretty ripe pick right there. I mean, there aren't any women. Obviously, you're not going to be into any <laughs> what other choice you got. <laughs> Come on, dog. This place is depressing as hell. How do you know it tastes like gasoline? Why did they have to wear these masks? Is there someone with the air? Oh, we getting a fight scene? Tight. <laughs> you just know immediately, dog. <laughs> or he's just gonna run. That'd be cool too. Why is there a whole army? Do you know this man? Pissed him off. I'll show you what vicious is. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> he is mad. What did you? <laughs> he fell all up in there. God. Oh my. He is. Oh, y'all pissed him the hell off. You're pissing him off two times over, dog. God, you're stupid. Pissed him off twice. <laughs> called him vicious and called his girl a wench. How dare you? Sorry about that. Oh. 
Oh, Grin, okay. They really got a whole channel for bounties. <laughs> You know how much money you can make in here? He thinks he has a bounty. <laughs> you, you wanted someone to chase you? You fucking freak. <laughs> Y'all getting your ass beat twice in a day? You ought to know when you to give up. <laughs> he really thought she was about to get jumped. Nah, she would have. She would have thrown hands, dog. You don't know who she is. <laughs> he didn't see how confident that kick was. So is Faye about to fall for a bounty? Is that what's going to happen? I say vodka. Better not taste like gasoline. <laughs> Did she leave because she started to? I'm guessing she left because she started to care for them. She's like, I don't want this. I don't want friends. There you go. Talk to her. But he definitely played that saxophone like God told him to, that's for sure. Still don't got a mask on. <laughs> Now there's a very thick tension in the air. I don't know if it's suspicion or sexual, <laughs> but it's one of those two things. <laughs> that guy's very suspicious. There's also a very thick sexual aroma going on around here, even though he's not attracted. <laughs> you can see the tension, bro. You can see it.
they said uh was it him and vicious that are like old war buddies or something yeah So what's her game plan? Now she knows about this. Here we go. You're an original, aren't you? Cowboy. You got the katana. Bring a sword to a gunfight. So there's some history between Spike and Lin. So I don't work under you or whatever. She just gonna blast him. You're an original, aren't you? Cowboy. Got a gun too. Whoa, 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 ho, ho, hold up. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> what happened here? Hold the phone. Do I cut that out? <laughs> I'm assuming I cut that out. I don't think I could show that. <laughs> Yo. Spike let himself get shot? That's to be a shoulder shot. Where? Where? You can't do that to be continued. No! No! That caught me so off guard. <laughs> and I assume the dude wasn't into chicks because... <laughs> So many different lanes that they, and they foreshadow it, but still. How many different lanes did we go through in this whole episode? This, this is by far the best one so far. Never has Faye blushed. That was... I don't even know what to say about that episode, dog. I was expecting a full-on Spike versus Vicious Spike back. That shit would turn sideways 180, 360 at the same time. I don't know how, but it did it. That was wild, bro. Absolutely wild. Oh my god. Can I show that? I'll, I know you can't show that. <laughs> that was funny, though. I'll get out. That was crazy. That was a crazy plot. The best plot twist we probably had so far. <laughs> I'm like, wait, titties? Wait, who, who's, bro? Oh my god. There's that. <laughs> There's that episode. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, what, what review can I give to that? That's the best one we've seen so far, without a doubt. Without a doubt. I mean, they definitely tease, but if they're willing to show nudity in this series, why, why tease as much as they've done so far? <laughs> I guess the main cast can't get none, but when it's side characters, it, it's it's complete it's free reign, okay? <laughs> this was a great episode, though. I did like it. Um, there was definitely, uh, it wasn't even a depressing tone, but um, it was, I don't even know how to explain it. It, it was very flip-floppy, you know what I mean? It, it, it went in opposite directions very quick you it was either depressing or hyped you know what i mean there 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 it was very like up here and down here just real quick like the moment they mistake spike for vicious the moment uh Faye heard vicious on the line it was just like from here because that scene before with her just talking to grim she was just like down here but then it just went like that. It was like boom, 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 boom. The tension hits like this too. It's crazy, bro. The build up with this is a great episode. I love this one. Um, on top of that, uh, 
for plot devices at least i definitely like the tie back um because for the most part the series has been one off um you know this episode is everything was self-contained for the most part but um i don't know this was definitely the first time we got something that tied back to a pivotal moment that we saw last because last time you heard about vicious was what episode five six something like that so this was definitely a good one to see i really like this um i really like when it's able to tie back like that because i think that's the only thing that was holding the series back for me i don't really know who these characters are where they came from so we, we know what we got but we don't really know what we didn't see when they were in the past because they definitely have a complicated past all of them for sure which is why i was so happy to see that jet episode um so this was definitely great to see i really like this one um and it, it's easy obviously i was joking it was kind of half joking but it's easy to judge Faye for just leaving and taking money but um knowing her character and what we've seen at least from her from the start um she's obviously a lone wolf and not wanting to open up to people if that's a part of her character it could play out to be something very interesting i'd really like to see that but um yeah that's what i was getting at like she's starting to care about them and she didn't want to be left or maybe that's something in her past like she she cared about she's cared about people and they left her and then she doesn't really like feeling that loneliness and she wanted to escape that because she was sort of seeing it coming she's like i'm starting to care about these people we're starting to have fun i can't let that happen i'm bouncing so i mean you, you see that in a lot of things like sort of people that don't really want that connection to be they think like caring about someone is a weakness or it's going to lead to something that you don't want to happen and i can i can understand that so if that's something they do with Faye, i'd be down for it completely um yeah i think that's all i can really say about this episode uh definitely gonna watch the next episode right, i have to watch the next episode right after this um the next episode will be uploaded right after as well so uh look out for that um but yeah that basically wraps up this one ladies and gentlemen hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode just as much as i did and i hope to see you all in the next one peace